Hey guys, it's Jillian from Cool Crafts. I really hope you're doing really well. I hope you're all well. I miss you guys so much. No camp this year, which is, I'm so upset. Um, this would have been my 18th year in camp. Such an old lady, but we're gonna have so much fun because you're gonna do camp in a box. So you'll get slime, you'll do a wind chime, you'll do candy sushi, you'll do oobleck, and you'll do tie dye. And also you can add whatever you want to these pieces. You can add your own imagination. Okay, so you're gonna get a box like this and everything will be in it, all that you need. So, right now we're gonna start on this wind chime. This is something pretty fun that you can do. And you're probably not really gonna need any help. Maybe, maybe you need to find a pair of scissors you have um, some fishing line here. You're gonna need three pieces. So you have three pieces of fishing line. You have your beads. These are so cool. As they get, as the sun comes onto these beads, they will change color. And some of them, I think, I do believe, will glow in the dark. So this is pretty simple, and I know you guys can do this. So here are your beads. You have three bells for each string. And you have a little stick like this. So this is gonna be your suspension. You're gonna, everything's going to suspend from here. And these all have three holes in them. So you'll have a hole here, a hole here, and a hole here. So what you need to do is tie the string into each hole. It's telling low battery. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna string, I'm gonna start stringing through. So you need to tie it really tightly. And this is really good because the fishing wire is extremely strong. So you're gonna thread it through, here we go. And you're gonna tie it really tight. Do two knots. I think you're good. I think I'm gonna take my gloves off guys because my gloves are not working for me. So you're gonna tie it. Jolly, jolly G's, guys. It's Jillian. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do another one. I think I'm getting old, guys. Somebody's gonna have to take over. Okay, here's another one. So you've got two strings. Make sure it's really tight. And then, so you've got your third one. And if you want to add different things to this too, you can, if you have some things at home that you like, that you want to add to this, you can definitely do that. So you're gonna string them all through. Make sure they're really tight. And pull it through and tie it double, okay? There's one, two, three. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna mix up your beads. You can do your colors, whatever you want. So it starts to look a little bit like this. I'm trying to be Martha here, guys. I'm trying to be Martha Stewart. So this would be your hanging, but you're gonna pour, you're gonna start threading your beads bit by bit. You can do any of the colors that you like. You might wanna do a pink one, you might wanna do a blue one. Or you can do a pattern, whatever you want. So you're going to thread. I'm going to use orange. You're going to get your beads and you start threading. Fantastic for fine motor, guys. So you're going to see how it is. 